What's up guys? Look at where we are at today. This is gonna be a good one. We got the boat launch, sorry I didn't film that. We are on the south fork of the Snake River and the reports are good. So hopefully it lives up to expectations. Hang tight, we're gonna catch a bunch of fish on this trip, but it's gonna be a great one. Make sure to follow the channel if you haven't done so already. And let's catch some fish. So, didn't take long. Jakey boy, he's had a hit. That's about it. Yeah. What are we running today, Jake? Should we take a look while you're tying this on? Yeah. Okay. So, Jake's running a, let's see, zoom in a little bit. Okay, see that? Yeah. There you go, like a little pheasant tail type deal, uh, about a size 18. Oh, uh, and I just stabbed my finger. And then we got underneath, little Pertagon deal going on same thing so this is what the shop says have been hitting it's still a little cool we're out here about 10 a.m almost 10 a.m it's a little bit before 10 so it's still about 38 40 40 degrees somewhere in there oh dude big old fish just rose out of that man his head yeah. just came up and should I go try and get him yeah yeah Jake boys hooked up to the first fish of the day Dry dropper, he took you underneath fly. Yeah. You son of a bee. I'm over here nymphing, and you catching him on the dry. I think he took the... He took that dropper. Yeah. Right on, easy. Nice job, buddy. Nice job. Feel my finger. Oh, that's a puny little guy. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Let's see, Jake, that's the first fishy of the day. He took that. Oh yeah, that's a little rainbow. Nice, bud. That's the little Frenchy. Let's see the fish. Nice, buddy, a little rainbow. Sweet, okay, put him back. Woo! Sweet, dude. What? I just saw it flash underneath your thing. I didn't even I didn't really realize it. Here did I. I was just like, your thing's underneath. <laughs> that... My dry fly, and I just kind of. So he took that, huh? I wonder if I should switch over to that then. You just caught him right up in here too. I didn't even. I wasn't even pulling. Son of a gun! I think my he... fly came out, dude. Yeah, it did. That was a big fish, bro. That was a real big fish. Oh, it ripped both of them off. I wasn't even pulling. I was just keeping it tight. Dang. <laughs> he ate that dry, I think. Yeah, he did. I saw it come up to it and pulled too late. Just I'm about to say F it and just do the dry dropper because that's all that's been catching fish. That's two hits you've had right here. Let's put another uh, chubby. chubby I would or a grasshopper or something. Well, folks, Jake's caught one to the boat. He hit two, both of which have been on the chubby. So he's gonna switch to the chubby, I'm gonna float him down. I know they said the chubby hit was off, but that is all we've got hits on. So we're gonna try that. We're gonna float down this little section here. See if he can't pound the bank and get us a nice, nice fish. That last one was nice, Jake. It was a good one. Uh, if someone's tip it would have been stronger. Or it oh. Would have been in the boat. Oh, so the tire's fault. Yep. Mm. Sounds like some excuses, Jacob. <laughs> excuses don't catch big fish. All right, let's get rolling. I'll switch your spots. It's been a great boat. It's rolling amazing. Did you roll your cankle? Did you roll your cankle? All right, Jake's on to another little guy. Nice job, bud. Yeah. Little, little rainbow. Woo! Killer baby. Took the second. Which one did he take? The red dart? Yeah. He's a red dart eater. Is that what that is? Yeah. Thanks. So, so the other one was? No, the other one was the uh, Frenchie. 
20. Nice. Hurry and set it up in there again. It's a good spot. <laughs> oh, I want a big one. <laughs> Let's see, Jake. <laughs> Yeet. Yeet the meat. Hey, better than nothing. Better than nothing, he says. Keep getting smaller. Okay, well, hurry. You still have good water. They <laughs> keep getting smaller, he says. Oh, right from this log, Jake. Well, that's nice. Hook's that. Look how pretty this is, everyone. Look at that. Wow. Finally, old Zach got onto one. Some, um, no, it's pretty deep, don't. No. It's pretty deep. It's a nice little cutty. Took the dry. Well, yeah, drop anchor right here. It ain't that deep, I don't think. Just step on it. Hold it down. Key on. Good stop. You net him for me. Nice, dude. He took the freaking dry. Is it decent? Oh, it's a nice cutthroat. Look at that. That's a nice cut. Can't complain about that, huh? Okay, there you go. Oh, there he goes. He's ready. Right, guys, so uh, we're stopping for lunch at this nice little spot. After we just caught fish out of here, we got uh, got the Sammy's Mountain Dew. It's wrapped. It's, yep. It's been a good time. We've landed, uh, what, six fish, probably ish, five or six. Uh -huh. So. It was slow at the start. It was slow at the start. It seems like it's picked up the last hour. Uh, fish are starting to rise. We're starting to see fish rise. So hopefully here, uh, it's 12:30 right now. Hopefully they start to come up with the heat coming out. We we'll get a little dry fly action. They've been taking the chubbies. A couple on a little pertagon. One on the red dart, right, Jake? Yep. So I don't know. Top waters seem to be kind of the thing, I guess. So we're just running a dry drop or do both. See what happens. So eat some lunch this place is beautiful absolutely beautiful even if you don't catch fish how can you complain about that it's awesome there's more to come because we got at least a 20 inch coming up you know i hope so because we keep saying we're gonna catch 20 inches it's gonna happen we're getting, we've got close but god dang all right i'm gonna eat some sammies get more big fish See, see, you see that a little Frenchie. It's all chewed up now. We caught a couple fish out of though. Jake's getting snacks. Jake just lost a big one in my camera battery. Died. Let me clean it off here. Jake, what the heck, dude? Yeah, we're reeling it in. And he got wrapped around the anchor, wrapped man. Wrapped around the anchor. That was a nice one too. Probably say at least 20 inch. Yeah, it was. It was big. It was big. That was <laughs> that was our fish of the day. So we freaking missed it, man. We're gonna try and get it re-rigged here. We're almost to the out. See if Jake can get one more before we get out of here. Dang it, man. Dang it. Alright. Well, it was a fabulous day. The most of a fabulous. Yep. Fabulosos. Fabulosos. Had a Probably I'd say at least a 20 inch are on, but got caught up in the anchor and still caught some nice rookies. Nice rookies. Yeah. So getting used to the boat, and Jake's getting used to catching fish. Yep. <laughs> We're getting out of the launch. It was a good, good day. Cannot complain with the scenery and the beautiful weather.
freaking awesome. Awesome, awesome. Much better doing it at 4,000 CFS than freaking 15. Much more enjoyable. So we're gonna load this bad boy up. We can get out of here, that was a good day. All right, boys and girls, that's a wrap. What do you think of the first time on the boat, Jake? It was pretty fun. It was pretty cool being able to uh, hook on to a big fish. Yeah, too bad. I didn't get on camera, my camera died. He hooked onto a nice one, took him under the boat. We got wrapped around the freaking anchor. Man, that was a nice fish though. Still caught a bunch. Um, it was a good day. Beautiful weather for October. Can't not complain about that. Will you go again? Oh yeah. All right. That's all that matters, man. It was fun. We can't complain about that. It was freaking awesome. I hadn't done that for a year, so I'll definitely have to come back here a lot more next year. The weather should be rolling in next week, and duck hunting should be hopefully picking up. But if you like the video, make sure you like the video, guys. I'd appreciate it, um, and we'll see you next time.